In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to resolve the your connection isn't private error in Microsoft Edge. This common issue can be quite frustrating, but don't worry, we're going to walk through some straightforward steps to help you tackle it effectively. First things first, one of the most common causes of this error is an incorrect system date and time. This is because SSL certificates rely heavily on accurate timestamps. So let's ensure your system's date and time are set correctly. To do this, press the Windows key along with the letter I to open your settings. From here, navigate to time and language and then select date and time. Once you're in the date and time settings, make sure both set time automatically and set time zone automatically are enabled. These settings will align your system's clock with the correct time, which might just solve the issue. After making these adjustments, go ahead and restart Microsoft Edge to see if your problem is resolved. If you're still encountering the error, the next thing to try is clearing your browsing data, including your cache and SSL state. Sometimes cached data can cause conflicts with the SSL certificates, resulting in the error message you're seeing. To clear this data, open Edge and type Edge or settings clear browser data in the address bar, then hit enter. This will take you to the data clearing settings. In this window, make sure to select browsing history, cached images and files, and cookies and site data. For the time range, choose all time to ensure everything is wiped clean, and then click on clear now. This action will remove any potentially problematic data and might fix the issue when you relaunch Edge. If the error persists after clearing your browsing data, there's another factor you should consider. Sometimes VPNs or antivirus software can interfere with SSL certificates. Some VPNs might block necessary connections and antivirus programs with SSL scanning features can sometimes cause issues. Temporarily disabling these tools could help identify if they are contributing to the problem. If you have an antivirus program like Avast or Kaspersky, check the settings and look for SSL scanning options and try turning this feature off. Similarly, if you're using a VPN, try turning it off to see if it clears up the error. Once you've tried these solutions, the issue should be resolved, allowing you to browse safely and securely without any interruptions. If you followed along, your connection on Microsoft Edge should now display as private. Thank you for joining me today, and I hope these steps have been helpful. If you have any other questions or topics you'd like us to cover, feel free to leave a comment below.